Hi there. Welcome to the supplementary video for Concept Fusion, open set multimodal 3D mapping. One of the central challenges in robotics is enabling robots to perceive and interact with their environment in an intelligent manner. Often, this task involves building 3D maps of the environment that encode not just visual information like colors, but also semantic concepts like objects and their properties, as in what is a chair, what is a table, etc. Most existing approaches for this suffer from two big limitations. Number one, they are closed set. This means they only incorporate semantics for a finite set of concepts, which are predefined at training time. Number two, the encoded semantic information can only be queried through predefined class labels, or in some more recent work, via text. To address these limitations, we present Concept Fusion, open set multimodal 3D mapping, a scene representation that is both completely open set and inherently multimodal. Let's take a look at some of the things Concept Fusion can do. Here's a point cloud reconstruction of a room. In addition to specific items, we can query the map with open set text queries, such as somewhere comfy to sit. This highlights both the sofa and the chairs in the room. Queries can be images. Here, we use a picture of a cabinet to highlight the cabinet in the scene. Even audio can be used as a query. Here, the sound of knocking on the door highlights the door in the room. And of course, we can also click on points within the reconstruction to find other points similar to it. Here, we click on the cabinet, and as you can see, the points with the highest similarity are colored red, and the points with the lowest similarity are colored blue. So, how does Concept Fusion do all of this? Our approach provides two key things. Number one, a novel mechanism by which to use foundation models to compute local per pixel embeddings as opposed to just image level embeddings. And number two, a mapping system that, given a series of images of a scene, allows us to build a 3D point cloud representation where those local per pixel features for each image are mapped and fused into a feature vector for each point in the point cloud. For more details on our method, please take a look at our paper. Let's jump back into our demos. Once we construct a map with our features, we can explore the semantic concepts they encode by visualizing clusters computed over the points in our scene. Here, we have examples with features from two different foundation models, and we can see that in both cases, the clusters naturally correspond to semantic concepts. Moreover, this works equally well on outdoor data. We can also support geometric queries, such as asking about the distance between the refrigerator and television in this room. Let's move on to some real-world experiments. We evaluate Concept Fusion on two robotic systems. First, we present results on an autonomous driving platform. Our map can be used to find places via a natural language description. In this example here, the car uses our map to locate, plan a path for, and finally, autonomously drive to a nearby roundabout. Here's another example where the car autonomously navigates to a nearby football field. The next set of experiments involve a robot arm performing tabletop manipulation tasks. Here, our map is used to identify and locate objects in a scene to a high degree of precision so that a robot arm can move the objects around. The exact queries used are seen above. Move Baymax to the right, and the Baymax toy is moved to the right. Here are some other tasks being performed for you to see.
Last but not least, our system can be queried in multiple languages. Here, we show the results for the query, a place to sit and relax, in six different languages. Okay, that's all for now. I hope this video has helped demonstrate the potential of our mapping system across a wide range of tasks. For more details and demos, please check out our project webpage linked here. Thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.